everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video i will be showing you guys my pandora collection i made uh, two previous videos where i showed you what's on my pandora bracelet but since then i got two more bracelets so i've got three bracelets uh, to share with you guys in this video i really love to see other people's collections so i really hope you guys will enjoy this if you are excited for this video don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and if you like to see vlogs lifestyle and fashion videos make sure you subscribe my baby boy is napping so i really hope i finish this video before he wakes up so let's get started like i said i've got three bracelets to share with you and this is the one that i showed you guys in my previous videos so i will uh, show you guys this last if you saw those and um, then you already know what's on here um okay so let's get started with the bangle so i really love this bangle um it's a very pretty design it's kind of a, a snowflake i guess in the center of it it got a very pretty uh, stone when the light catches it it really shines and i don't have any charms on this right now i just like to wear it plain because i like to stack it up with my other bracelets so that's why i don't have anything on it right now so this bracelet is 17 centimeters so it fits me really nicely and um, like i said i like to stack it up with my other bracelets so if you saw my previous video you know that i really wanted a two-toned bracelet and this is a very very special bracelet um, my father got me this uh, when i became a mom so it's my family bracelet that's the theme of this one so like i said this is a two-toned bracelet the clasp is rose gold and the bracelet itself is uh, silver and i believe this is 19 centimeters uh, like my other snake bracelet so i can fill it with charms i'm really sorry it's very cloudy today so sometimes the sun comes through and so the light can change a bit so i'm really sorry for that but yeah, let's get started with uh, this snake bracelet. So the first thing that you see is this safety chain. And I would really recommend uh, buying a safety chain for your bracelet. This chain will prevent your charms from falling off. It will be such a shame if you will lose any of your charms. I believe this safety chain is called the family tree. And um, like I said, this is my family bracelet. I really want to collect special moments with my family on this one. And uh, yeah, I just think it's very pretty and uh, goes really well with the bracelet. So then the first charm on here is a letter and this is for my baby boy Axel. He was born last year on 12 October 2022. And it's just so special to have his uh, initial on here. Then this next charm is all rose gold i think this is so pretty it got two little hearts with all little shiny stones on it and yeah i just really love this i've got a few dangly charms on here and i think that makes your bracelet more playful so yeah i think this is so pretty then the next charm on here is a daisy clasp um, I don't own any clip set on this bracelet so I got the clip from this bracelet on here so I need uh, two clips still for this bracelet but right now I just uh, put my daisy clip on here it's so so pretty it got all little stones in it um, very girly and pretty I really love this next charm it says uh, mom love you always with all little daisies it got a few um, colorful daisies as well a pink one and a purple one um yeah i just really love this and this is just so special since becoming a mom you know that i got to wear these kind of charms so yeah i absolutely love that one and then the last charm on my family bracelet is another dangly one this is a very pretty two-tone charm again with rose gold and silver it got again all little stones in it and it says uh, i love you forever um super pretty again so yeah i've got a few charms on here right now as you can see i've got quite a bit of uh, space left and i really love to stack these bracelets like this to wear them together i think it's just so pretty to have a two-toned bracelet let me know what you think of it and i've got another bracelet to show you guys and this is the bracelet that i shared in my previous videos and this is all filled up now i've got a little bit of space left but i like to wear it this way otherwise it's a bit tight on me it's because it got a uh, three um round charms and um, yeah they make the bracelet a little bit more thick so keep that in mind if you want to buy um, Murano um, charms 
So yeah, let's get started with this one. So this is again a snake bracelet, um, like the one I showed you. But um, this is all silver and like I said, this has the rose gold um, clasp. So this bracelet does not really have a theme. Yeah, it's kind of a girly Disney kind of theme, I guess. Um, so let's get started. So to match the heart clasp, I got a really cute uh, heart safety chain. Again, a safety chain, really recommend this. Um, and then the first charm that you see on here is this little present and this present I got when I got my driver license this was I believe one of the first charms I actually got um, a very cute little present then the first Murano charm that I got on here is a plain uh, pink one it got a little bit of a structure to it that you can see better in the close-up um, like I said, I've got three different pink Muranos and I think Muranos are a very nice way to add some color to your bracelet. So, uh, and they've got so many different colors. So um, yeah, you can go with a color theme that you like. Then the first Disney charm that I got on here is a Elsa dress. Uh, my sister got the Anna one, which is just so funny. And uh, yeah, I absolutely love Disney. Then the next term is a little heart, um, which got uh, love written on it in all different languages. Liebe, amore, love, amour. Um, yeah, very cute. And then the only clip that I got on here is this clip with a little bit of a golden touch. And it got a little golden dot in it, which is just a very cute, simple clip that goes with every bracelet, I guess. Then the next Murano got all little hearts in it. I think this is so pretty. Um, it really catches the light and um, yeah, I think this is such a nice charm. Then I got two spacers and this is a great charm to fill up your bracelet. Um, they are both uh, white daisies and I think they are so cute and girly. Again, if you like a floral girly theme, this goes really well with your bracelet. And in the middle of those daisies, I've got the Disneyland Paris charm and I just love Disney. So all of the Disney parks got their own castle and yeah you can only get them in the actual Disney parks so I'm very very happy with this one and hopefully we will be back soon um, with my baby boy I just can't wait for that the next term is a Christmas term and it says Merry Christmas I'm obsessed with Christmas um, so I think this is a very cute little charm to own if you enjoy the Christmas time and then the last Murano got all little glitters in it and I think this is my favorite one I just love it so much um, it's very nice and glittery. I love a little bit of glitter. Then the next Disney charm I have on here is Mickey and Minnie. And on the back it says love and kisses. Um, it got all little red stones in it. And as you can see, it's very nice and dangly. So pretty and how cute are they? Really love this. The next charm got all little hearts in like a creamy pinkish kind of shade. Um, and it also got two golden hearts in it and I just love this um, as you can see I've got quite a bit of a heart theme going on <laughs> really cute and adorable and then next to that charm I've got mini like I said I love Disney and this was actually my first uh, Disney charm when they released the Disney uh, charms in Europe and that was I believe in 2018 so yeah I think that is so cute then the last charm on here I got from my grandma and it says granddaughter and I got this from her a few years back now and it also got a little um, pink stone in it it's so pretty and uh, yeah very special to me as well and then the last jewelry piece I got from Pandora is this princess ring I really love this I like to stick it up with some other rings um, yeah, this is just a really classic Pandora ring, isn't it? And then I want to share a tip with you guys. This is the Pandora Jewelry Care Kit. And this is amazing to clean your jewelry with. So it comes in this little box. So in this jewelry kit, you get the Pandora uh, Gentle Cleaner. You get a cloth and a little brush. Um, I really love this. You put your jewelry in here for about two or three minutes. You take it out, rinse it off with a little bit of um, 
warm water. Then I take my brush to clean the jewelry with. And after that, I also use a cloth to really make them shine. So I really think this is a great way to clean your uh, jewelry with because I quite struggled with that before um, to make them really shine. And I think this is just a great way. So this is my Pandora collection of 2023. I'm just so happy with all of the uh, charms and pieces that I got. I think Pandora jewelry is just a great way to collect some memories and yeah, I just, I just love it. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm happy because my baby boy is still sleeping. Give it a huge thumbs up for my baby boy Axel that he's still sleeping. <laughs> Bless him. If you like to see fashion related videos, vlogs, uh, videos about motherhood, make sure you subscribe. And I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye.